academic integrity is an issue that we need to talk about uh, as part of our freshman seminar requirement and as part of the Penn State principles so let's look at uh, what is academic integrity and <clears throat> we can define it as the pursuit of scholarly activity in an open honest and responsible manner well, what does that mean well so what we're talking about there is that you're getting an education while you're in school and you're going to be doing a lot of work and basically the work that you're doing should be your work and not someone else's work. That what you're turning in should be uh, an expression of your effort and your learning and you're being evaluated on what you have learned and how you can uh, demonstrate that. So um, whether it's group projects, you should at least contribute to the group. If it's an individual assignment, you should uh, do that individually. So, and maybe why do you need to be concerned about this? Well, when there are violations of academic integrity, um, you can be affected by that, um, by the, the uh, sanctions that come against you. Um, so if you uh, don't follow ac these academic values, then there could be issues with um, disciplinary sanctions against you and things like that that affect your grade and your performance in school and also um, it maybe also affects those around you in that um, if you're getting unfair treatment it doesn't uh, if you're getting like you're cheating and things like that then other people will learn that eventually and then it kind of puts a uh, either it, it grows more or people get upset about that and so it, it adds into a, a negative atmosphere in the learning environment so sanctions that can happen depend on mainly on the severity of the violation. So if it's uh, maybe a, a, just a regular homework assignment, a lot of times you'll just maybe get a, a zero on the assignment and told not to do it again. And that would be maybe a minor infraction. Um, if you were helping someone else by giving them maybe a, an old project to turn in, um, then that would be maybe a little bit more major of an offense if it's a, if it's a larger weighted assignment um, that both parties can get in trouble for that. Though that person that turned it in and also the person that, that gave it to them. Um, maybe it's something more severe or maybe if it happens more often, if you get caught a number of times, um, the, that increases the severity of the punishment and either you can maybe get a failing grade on assignment or maybe even in the class or maybe you can even get kicked out of school if, if there's enough violations against that. So. It also can be harmful overall to the community. I already talked about that already, that it's, it's a negative impact on the learning environment and other people think that it's unfair. Why should I work hard if someone else is not going to work hard and still get a good grade? And it also rep, uh, harms the reputation of the university. Um, you've seen other schools where uh, maybe certain individuals were shown special treatment and that kind of ruins their, uh, kind of their reputation for academics at that school. So that's something we don't want to happen here at Penn State if we can avoid it. So overall, what we're trying to ask you to do is to practice integrity when you are going through your educational process. So, so we want you to make sure that you're getting a quality education, that you're learning a lot while you're here, uh, that you're being trained to work in the field, that you're gonna go out and, and be an expert in your, in your field and a, and a valued employee. So we're trying to give you some skills while you're here. We wanna make sure that you know those skills um, before you before you leave you may not need all the skills in your specific job but um, someone might so we have to kind of give a broad general uh, list of skills that we want to make sure that everyone meets and then um, as you go out you'll be able to to use those so it's not just a matter of jumping through hoops it's there's a purpose behind what, what we're teaching and um, you, while you're here you have the opportunity to learn you're trying to learn try to learn as much as possible while you're here uh, in order to become a better engineer and in order to uh, be better prepared for when you go out into the work field so we ask you just not to sacrifice uh, what you're you're learning and your reputation in order just to get maybe a higher grade on an assignment or on a project um, and maybe in class and we want you to be the best engineer that you can be in the end so so please take that into consideration and we ask that you know that we all practice academic integrity.